Leute. Hey, are you blind or something? Hey, buddy, please excuse us. She's still learning. Women. So what? I'm looking at at least $500 worth of damage here. I'm calling the police. But why? Honey, write this man a check for uh, $1,000. I hope that the additional 500 bucks will compensate for moral damages. Sure, nice. Man, just be careful next time, okay? Yes, you will. Good luck, buddy. No, 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 no. I changed my mind. Is there something wrong with the soul check? I call in the cops. Let me add a couple hundred more. Listen, she needs to face the consequences of the law, so this won't happen again. Okay. You know what? What? I like this. I love Principal Man! Call the cops, but let me buy you a coffee in convenience, so to say. I don't mind. Nice. <laughs> we will be back, man. Oh, come on, honey. It's just a car. It's okay. Oh, she's so scared. Come on, come on, come on. Hey, baby, it's okay. Come on, let's go. Don't worry, don't worry. Hello? Yeah, okay. Sugar? Are the cops coming soon? Just five minutes. Oh. We've got a time to finish our coffee. Um, so, uh, what do you do anyway? Uh, let's skip this part, okay? Whatever you say, buddy. Whatever you say. Good day. Who called us here? Uh, uh, okay. Thanks, God, officer. You're here. This man crashed into us. They started reading us. Look at him. He's definitely on Thompson. What? No! No! Yes! No. It seems pretty clear what's going on here, Ethan. Hey, listen, I show you. I, I called you. That's not true. I called you from his phone. My phone just died. And you couldn't use your wife's phone, huh? My... mine died too. And yours too, really? We're in a vacation, officers. Two days on the road. It, it, it's not true. She's in danger. Check. That's nonsense. You're bumbling. Look at you. You're so drunk, man. You can't even spell two words. Check him, please. Ma'am, can I see your ID, please? Why? I'm not talking to you, sir. Okay. Thank you. Looks like everything is all right, officer. One last request, ma'am. What request? Could you please roll up your sleeves and show me your arms? Can you believe this jerk? If you have nothing to worry about, just let her do. Listen here. Mind your own business. You came for traffic accident call. So just deal with it. If you meddle further, Clark Rogers, head of the Lawyers Association. I can destroy both you and your partner just in two phone calls. Is that clear? Do you understand what I'm talking about? Buddy, we gotta go. This is 
No, they have a business. Come on. What are you up to? Sir, did you drink this? <laughs> Come on, little enough. One last question, sir. Is this true that men who beat their wives just can't satisfy them? What? You know what I'm talking about. I've always been curious about it, really. Freeze, hands up! <laughs> Excellent. Assembling to the police officer. Now you have to go with us. You regret this? Of course. Oh, you have no idea what I'll do to you. I've already used my right to a phone call. Chief Prosecutor will personally deal with you. Get ready, you're in the fort of right. I wouldn't be so confident if I were you. Oh, really? You wanna play? Bring it on, bring it on me. What have you got, huh? Assaulting an officer? Man, there's a camera with a sound in the parking lot that clearly showed. You provoked me. Anything else? This is the cup from which Bill, whom you accused of being a drug addict, drank coffee. And guess what? The analysis showed a huge dose of sedatives in the coffee. What does it have to do with me, huh? Your name is written on the cup. <laughs> My name on the cup? If that's your trump card, you want to destroy me with the name on the cup? <laughs> You're hilarious, buddy. Do you know how many clerks could bet in the parking lot and throw that cup in the trash, huh? I tell you, I don't. You have nothing on me. My thoughts exactly. Good thing that your wife came here with us to the station, right? <laughs> what do you mean? We ran a blood test on her. Guess what? It showed she's on the same drug we found in the coffee. And you know, those pieces of evidence gave her a confidence. She told us everything and she's pressing a charge against you, Mr. Rogers, for domestic violence. Um... Hey, buddy. Um... We started off on the wrong foot, right? I'm sorry for my stupid jokes. I'm, I'm really sorry for that. But what do you want? You want to become the youngest commissioner in the city's history, right? Or maybe you want to transfer to SOS, to a warmer place. Easy job. I can't arrange it. Don't embarrass yourself, Mr. Rogers. By the way, you mentioned a prosecutor friend, yeah? You can say hi to him. He's in a jacket room, listening to us through the microphone. Think on it. Wait. Uh Thank you, sir. You've been a great help to us. I just couldn't turn a blind eye to it. Officer, I apologize, but could you lend me a couple of dollars for a taxi? I lent all my money in the car. Don't worry. You will get it right. <laughs>